cameras from my bedroom. It's invasive and unacceptable. The chief caster can watch my life if she chooses. It was mentioned earlier that the structures, like my condo, can be blocked out, but the city has not demonstrated that they have the real-time 3D motion tracking in place to accomplish this. It's not a fixed-point camera. The cameras can zoom and move, so blocking out a structure is not an easy task. Downtown Tampa doesn't have a crime problem. Over the last five years, I've walked around downtown at all hours and have never seen a situation where CCTV would help. The facial recognition cameras installed in the Ebor in advance of the Super Bowl years ago, they managed zero arrests. To my knowledge, the cameras in downtown have also aided in zero investigations. I seriously doubt that the mayor or Chief Caster or any of you on the council would characterize downtown as unsafe. If you look at a map of crime in Tampa, downtown is not where you would spend $2 million. And by the way, Mr. Reddick, that was all federal money, so equal representation would be to distribute the cameras across 50 states and not just to record littering in District 5. We were not looking at installing these cameras prior to the RNC. The RNC has come and gone, and it's time for their CCTV cameras to go with it.